Hiya. If you travel around Ireland, you'll see plenty of places that have eagles on their gateposts. Well, here in Ballymote in Sligo is one place where the eagles on the gateposts are absolutely appropriate. And I was here a few years ago with children, and it was a great place to visit, and I'm hoping that it's open again. So I'm just going to head down and have a look. This is an animal sanctuary, more specifically a bird sanctuary. They specialise in birds of prey. Not only do they mine them, but they also put on shows with them. Now the whole idea of using animals to entertain people is unsettling, until you see it done by this man, Lothar Moshkitat. Now because I'm supposed to start the show 15 minutes ago. Okay. Lothar is a bird maven. He's fascinated by birds of prey, but he's also keen to pass on his love of them. A long story, um, we, we bought this place to retire, and um, in 2003 we decided to support the reintroduction program of different um, bird of prey species. The program is run by the Golden Eagle Trust, but we had birds here for research purposes, and we thought, why shouldn't we use them to educate people? And that's how the whole story started. And does anybody say to you, oh, these are lovely bird, wild birds, you shouldn't use them in a show? Uh, no, 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 because they are not wild birds, they are all bred in captivity. But um, if they help to make their wild kin survive, why shouldn't they do this job? But before we see some wing action, just a few words about this place and birds of prey in general. Birds of prey, not this guy here. <laughs> okay, um, this is very likely one of our former patients. Bertie, good morning. Yeah. Uh, this is Bertie. Bertie, a heron. Um, and by the way, food donations are welcome, but wait until after the show. Okay? <laughs> So, this is the shoulder, this is the upper arm, this is the lower arm, and these are the fingers. The idea of using shows to pass on his love of birds didn't come to Lothar from show business, but from academia. I was a lecturer at the university and I had to learn that uh, you can present the most interesting stuff, um, but if you're not captivating uh, people, they fall asleep. And um, yeah, over many, many years, um, I, I learned that you have to edutain. Yeah. Don't play with the phone here, you're not here for fun. <laughs> <laughs> right? The hair is off, I'm Are you ready? Good luck. <laughs> hey, come on! <laughs> Not too bad, huh? <laughs> <laughs> but hawks have very big feet and massive claws. They kill with them. They stab the prey. But on the other hand, birds of prey are not invincible or invulnerable. If you look a little bit higher, you can see these very thin legs. They look like skin and bone. But there's more. There are sinews, tendons, nerves, blood vessels. Important things. Highly concentrated. If such a bird makes a mistake, if she grabs a rat by the tail and only if she misses the head, this rat has a chance to turn around and fight back. They are not happy to be killed. And give the chance, they will use their teeth. And whatever they cut will leave the bird injured, paralyzed. Hunting is for bird of prey no passion or pastime. It costs a lot of body energy and it's very dangerous. It might cost their life. And this is why they do not go for the strong and the healthy ones. They leave them to survive, to reproduce. They wait until they meet the guys who carry an infection, the slow, the sick ones, the ones that are unable to escape and too weak to fight back. And by taking them out of the population, they make sure diseases won't spread. So predators, altogether, not only birds of prey, are the vets of nature. They're very, very important. Turkey vultures are now spreading far into Canada. Um, Tim will take on Lawrence, aka the killer. <laughs> okay. 
Okay, are you ready? Okay, let's go for it. Let's go! So, as well as lots of tidbits of information about the birds, Lothar also has lots of one-liners and gags. Some of Lothar's gags, though, are very old. What's the most unusual question people have asked you during the shows? Or if you ask me which is the most common question. Most common then, yeah. <laughs> uh, which is my favourite bird? And what is it? My wife. <laughs> <laughs> Come on! Lothar and the Eagles Flying Centre in Ballymote, County Sligo. <laughs> <laughs> 